today we're going to talk about five things not to do when you're facing criminal charges. I'm Steve Kramer of the Kramer Law Firm. I'm a Florida criminal defense attorney. And we're going to talk about the top five things that you should not do. Number one, don't talk to the police after you're arrested. That means when the cuffs go on, when the lights are on, when you're in custody, don't make any statements. It's a good idea to exercise your right to remain silent. Two, don't consent to a search of the vehicle. You don't have the obligation, it is your constitutional right to avoid unreasonable searches and seizures and you should absolutely exercise it. Now a lot of times in that situation you will be pushed and prodded. You might hear something like, look it's going to go a lot better tonight if you let me search your vehicle, I'll let you go home, we'll make this all better. Don't believe it, it's not worth it. You need to exercise your constitutional rights to remain silent and to be free from searches because these these issues can have huge impacts in your case. Next is be respectful to the police. They're doing their job, they're trying to do the best that they can, and don't talk back. If you get an attitude, if you got angry, things can get a lot worse. Sometimes you can be charged in a different way than you might be otherwise. Sometimes you might get arrested just for mouthing off or interfering with an investigation or obstructing justice or resisting arrest. There's a lot of bad things that can happen. Be polite. Yes, officer. No, officer. Next, don't represent yourself. You need an attorney. A good private attorney can help you out in your case in ways that you can't imagine. We have tools and tricks and skills that can really help out your case. Maybe you know what emotion to suppress is. But if you don't, you probably want an attorney because that's something that can make your case go away, that could resolve it just in an instant. And the last thing is, don't listen to other non-lawyer opinions about your case. Meaning, your friend may have had something very similar and may be telling you a story, but don't listen to that stuff. Because people, sometimes they tend to exaggerate, sometimes they don't remember it the way it happened, and sometimes their scenario just isn't like yours. And every, everybody's got a story to tell. But the only story that matters for you is your own case. Why am I telling you this? Because if you're dealing with a criminal charge, or if you get pulled over ever, you need to know this information. You need to know your rights. I deal with this stuff every day, and I'm here to help. Call me at the number below to talk. Also, if you're watching this video on YouTube or on Facebook, click the like button. This way your friends and family can benefit from the information that I'm sharing with you. Don't forget to call me. Thanks for watching. I'm Steve Kramer of the Kramer Law Firm.